Alright, so a very good morning everyone. Okay, nice to see all of you once again. How are you doing today? And have you finished your breakfast yet? Of course, right? And are you ready for our online class today as well? Today is Wednesday, June, okay, 24, 2020, right? And today as well, in the first session, we are going to continue our hangout lesson. And in the second session, we will continue our, okay, and practice our grammar lesson, okay? So, all right, so today we will move to, un okay, sorry, we will move to page 35 altogether. So if you're at home, you can open your book to page 35 altogether, okay? And, okay, we are going to, okay, listen and say regarding to section A that we will, okay, focus on track 033. But before we go further to our, okay, lesson and the vocabularies today, teacher would like to, okay, sum up and review a little bit regarding to, okay, the lesson that we learned, okay, in the previous video. Do you still remember what did we learned yesterday? Of course, right? We learned about okay one short story that okay related to the okay Alex, okay Emma, Brian, and their grandpa, right? And for grandpa, okay, regarding to the story, grandpa he used to okay develop photos, okay, in the attic, okay, the attic. And for Brian and Alex, Emma, at that time, okay, they were okay making a film right in order to show their grandpa right and for alex he thinks that okay phone is easier okay to use than okay the camera because he said that okay because of the technology advancements okay so um for camera is somehow okay it's a little bit hard to use while phone it is easier to use okay to record a video okay so Yes, that's it for our short stories. Teacher, hope you all okay review more and read more regarding to our okay story. And yeah, that's it. Now let's move on to our lesson today. Today we will move to okay page thirty five altogether. So if you at home, you can open your book to page thirty five, and then you will see here. Okay, there are eight okay words in this okay section section A. Listen and say, okay, and here you can see here maybe it's okay, a baby, right? Maybe what is she doing? Can you guess? And here a little girl, okay, and a little boy he is sleeping, right? And here a mother and a, okay, a sweet a little daughter. Maybe they are talking to each other, maybe they play, okay, playing with each other. And here a little girl with a small, okay doll okay you can say like that and here a little girl and two little boys okay maybe they are doing something here around their house okay and this girl maybe she cries okay? she's crying okay and here this little girl she smile okay so in each picture they also have each words okay so now okay the child we have moved to section a which is listen and say okay Alright, so everyone, you can, okay, listen all together. So now they just give all of you three minutes to listen to these vocabularies. And don't forget to try, okay, pronouncing the words, okay, in order to improve your pronunciation, okay? And now, yes, let's go all together. And after you come back from your listening, teacher will read it for all of you as well as explain you and give more definitions for all of you regarding to those vocabularies. Okay, so now you're ready? Let's go. A. Listen and say. Number one. Crawl. Number two. Fall down. Number three. Take naps. Number four. Have a babysitter. Number five. Name toys. Number six. Catch butterflies. Number seven. Cry a lot. Number eight. Feed your siblings. 
Excellent job, everyone. So now, okay, let us okay read all together. Teacher, believe that you know how to okay pronounce those words as well, right? So the first word is the word crawl. Okay, crawl. Okay, its function as what means to move forward. Okay, on your hands and knees with your body close to the ground. So mostly when a baby, okay, they okay, just was born. Okay, when the okay, the baby, okay just born so somehow they cannot crawl okay on the floor on the ground but after they grow up a little bit they can okay start to, to crawling okay so crawl okay mean to move forward on your hand and knees with your body close to the ground and another word is the word fall down fall down okay it's mean to drop suddenly or collapse okay to suddenly stop standing so collapse it seems like okay uh, okay, you drop suddenly or collapse, okay, or suddenly stop standing, okay? And another word is the word take naps. Take naps. Me, okay, functional phrase so as well means to sleep briefly, especially during the day. So after a long day or after your tired day, you can actually relax a little bit and then you can say, um, let me take a nap. Okay, so that you can relax. Okay, so mean to sleep briefly. Okay, especially during the day. Okay, and another word is the word okay, have a baby Okay, have a babysitter. Babysitter. Okay, have a babysitter. Okay, mean okay function as rest of the verb means to be in the care of a person who looks after children. Look after. Okay, or take care. Okay, usually during a short absence of parents. For example, you have okay your little sister and your little brother at home, and you are the oldest okay sister like me. So when my parents they okay went to province, okay, so I have to take care or I have to okay have a baby sister, okay, for okay my okay little brother and my little sister. So I need to take care of them. I need to look after dumb okay in a, a short period of time after okay my parents come back so that okay they can okay look after them another first of is okay name toys name toys okay mean to give name to one's play things okay for example in when you was a child when you was young okay, right um when you were young maybe actually you experience okay names toys like you have a doll or you have a toys that you put their name okay like ah i call it tommy so it means you name your toys okay means to give okay names to one's things you understand another word another pressure is the phrase of catch butterflies catch butterflies phrase of word means to collect butterflies for enjoyment to collect butterflies for enjoyment you understand? And another phrase of is the word cry a lot. Okay, cries a lot mean to frequently or easily shed okay tear often noisily. Um, do you have your okay little sister or little brothers who okay likes crying? Like they cry a lot. Okay, um, two or three times a day they cry a lot. When I was young, my mom said that I also cry a lot. I like crying. Is you can use this phrase of to okay tell someone that ah uh, this baby he cries a lot. You see, and another phrase of verb is the word feed your sibling. Feed your siblings. Phrase of verb means to give food to one brother or sisters. Mean you feed them food, right? Okay, so when okay your parents okay are not at home, you can actually feed your okay little brother or little sister. So you can use the phrase word. I always feed my siblings, for example. Okay, so yes, that's it for the definition as well as the pronunciation of those words. So now let's just show all of you once again. So here, okay, the word okay. Crawl, okay, crawl, okay. Number two, the word fall down. Number three, okay, take naps, because okay, the boy is sleeping here. He's take okay, short naps, naps, okay. And have a babysitter, okay, have a babysitter. And another one, number five, 
name toys. See, there's a lot of toys that she names. Okay, that okay, words named by her. Okay, and here number six, catch okay, butterflies. Maybe you experienced before the boy and the girl they are okay trying to catch the butterflies here. And number seven, see, cries a lot. Okay, cries a lot. And number eight, feed your sibling. Okay, feed your siblings. Wow, excellent job, everyone. So now we finished the okay our vocabulary today lesson. So in the first session, okay, teacher just okay clarify regarding to the vocabularies, and hope to all of you try to pronounce okay the words more. And yeah, that's it for our first session of today. But before we have a break, teacher would like to sum up a little bit regarding to what we learned so far of today lesson. So today we actually okay review a little bit regarding to a short story that related to Grandpa and Brian, Alex, and Emma. Okay, that they okay want to show their Grandpa okay, a films. And we also move on to Unit 3 once again, okay, thinking about the Paran Pick 35. And as you all have already okay, practiced earlier, we can okay, listen and say regarding to the vocabularies okay, in okay, our textbook on Pick 35. And teacher also explain you as well. So the word that we we'll learned today, we have the word crawl, okay, the word fall down, the word take naps, okay, the word have a, be a babysitter. Okay. Names toys, okay, catch butterflies, and okay, cry a lot as well as you feed your siblings, okay? So, yes, actually you can use those words to, okay, show about the activities that you do and mostly it related to, okay, um, children or a little, okay, or baby, okay? So you can, okay, um, use those words to describe your experience somehow about your experience when you were okay younger for example like when I was okay younger I used to crawl a lot or I used to catch a butterfly you see you can use those words as well so that's it for our first session thank you everyone for your paying attention and hope you all have a great okay break and see you again in the second session all together goodbye